of Kano. Besides, Alaji Aminu Adubayo CFA. I think the traditional institution has always been like that. Uh, maybe time changes everything, and uh, they say time is something from God, and there is nothing anyone can do. But when you look at the traditional institution before the colonial era, during the colonial era, and after the colonial era, it is an institution that has remained constant. The changes are there, but the values, the traditions are kept that whoever comes in will just queue in and it is perfect for us. So the traditional institution has always been a, the gap bridger between all the all parts of the country. Uh, certainly that's why when I became the Emir of Kano about four or five years back, I went around virtually all the states of the Federation. And uh, this, my visit here, is a continuation of what I've been doing. But uh, this is very special because, like I said, the Aujale is an enigma. He's uh, a ruler with a difference. He's a leader that we all need to know and copy from. And Alhamdulillah, I'm happy in my lifetime, in my reign, I'm here. And the experience I tapped from him today is experience that will live forever in me. Sir, what would you say that Kano Emirates and finally, what would you say Kano Emirates and Ijebu share? Uh, Kano and uh, Ijebu, I look at them like twins as far as I'm concerned, especially in terms of uh, commercial activities. We all know Ijebu very well. And this Kano is just a carbon copy, or rather I would say Ijebu is the carbon copy of Kano. Uh, not Kano, the carbon copy, sorry for being selfish. But uh, the truth is uh, we have a lot of, in common. The religion, the culture, the tradition, and the most important thing, like I said, commercial activities. We are all traders, and uh, I think we have gained a lot. I cannot count the number of people from Ijebu in Kano, and I'm sure there are a lot of Kano people in Ijebu. So certainly, like I said, they are like twins, and uh, I hope this my visit will continue to bridge the gap. And like I said, I'm here in May, and I hope to be back in so I, I, we see it as a shake, handshake across the Niger. And it is um, believed that it's going to actually increase our relationship uh, positively between the Jebu Kingdom, the Jebu Land, and the Kano uh, Emirates. So it's a very welcome uh, development, and uh, we are happy that uh, everything went successfully without any itch.